back to Thousands of Roots. It is the end of July here in the Ozarks and it is heating up. So we're enjoying the coolness of the morning. This is just a typical summer morning here on our off-grid homestead. Morning, David. What you up to? Well, I've been up to collect the nuts and find some things. I don't know what they are. Those look like fava beans. Found some papa beans, huh? Good morning, girls. How are you? What'd you find? Is that a long noodle bean? Long noodle <laughs> She doesn't care about the beans. She just wants to find all the other little crumbs, huh? Whoa, this is a giant bean. <laughs> Chinese long noodle beans. They are big, huh? Yeah. How do you like the giant long, long little beanie? This one's my favorite. That's my one. Good morning, Josh. Morning, Mama. Bug. How are you this morning? Mm, okay. You got a little sore throat, huh? Yeah. But it goes away soon. Mm -hmm. Morning, Caleb. Morning. How's it going out here? It's going pretty good. Nice and cool still, huh? Mm-hmm. What you working on? I'm just working on bringing the jar, yeah, Berkey jars inside. Oh, yep. Getting water for a Berkey and you just took care of the ducks? Huh? Yeah. How are the ducks this morning? Looking pretty good. Cool. Getting your morning water. <laughs> I'll drink a lot of water in the mornings. Ooh, what's that, Esther Pie? I'm pressing a flower. Is that a hibiscus? Yep. It's doing good. You just started that a couple days ago, huh? Mm-hmm. Super pretty. Jay's checking out to see if we have a watermelon ready. What do you think, Jay? You thought maybe this one here? Why do you think this one might be ready? I think the dog sounds right in here. Looks yeah, when you look on the bottom, it's not, it's kind of all got its the same color as the top. It doesn't have that pale part on the bottom anymore, and I've heard that that means it's ripe. We've tried a couple already in the last week or so, and they've been good, but not quite ripe, huh? So, Jay. You decided you think we should wait one more day, right? Mm -hmm. On this watermelon? Mm -hmm. Just to make sure it's nice and sweet, huh? Mm -hmm. Like one or two. <laughs> yeah. This is a good year for watermelons for us, though. We're doing the orange glow. That's our favorite. And they're just everywhere. So many of them. I think I counted like 14 or something in this little patch. And we only, I think we only did about five or six plants. So that's pretty good. I think that's super good. Super good, yep. <laughs> the girls are laying down now, trying to keep cool in the shade here. Is it hot out? Yeah. Hot days ahead. Such sweet cows. That's Lil, the one that we milk every day. It's hard to see her in the shade, but that's Dandy. She's our second milk cow. Alright, you guys ready to eat? Yep. Get the food out of the oven yep. and I'm ready. have some breakfast. Yep. <laughs> Thanks for holding baby girl. The children all help out with her in the mornings so that I can run around, make breakfast. Good morning. Pulling it down, Jay Bud? Not really. He's mixing it up. Mixing I'm it up to help, it down. to help cool it down, huh? Right, we are going to sit down and enjoy breakfast and that's usually the time that we talk through homeschooling and projects for the day and um, any events happening for the day. 
almost forgot Kip's coffee. Get that ready. I like to have everything done before I sit down and get that for breakfast. Just got Abby down for a nap. And after breakfast is milking time. Josh is spraying the flies. We have a major fly problem this year. We've been doing all kinds of things to try and limit them. Hi girl. Good morning. Good morning. Nice and full this morning, that's good. Where are you off to, love? Go get the tractor so we can do some brush hogging. Yep, got a pasture that's out of control, so we're gonna yeah. get it into control, huh? The weeds are just tall as me, taller than me sometimes. Yep. You going along, Caleb? Yep. Driving the truck back. All right, see you in a little bit. And for the next two hours, I'm going to be tackling these dishes. <laughs> Yesterday was our day of rest, and uh, so I don't do dishes on that one day a week. So I've got double, <laughs> double dishes to do. Probably going to take me a couple hours, um, and that'll be the rest of the morning for me, because then it'll be time to make lunch. Um, while I'm doing that, uh, Esther Pie is sweeping the cabin, and then you'll have a little break. After the boys milk, they'll get their little break. And then I'll be on to projects and homeschool for the day, huh? Yep. <laughs> Don't do a lot of homeschool on Sundays. Just buddy time, Bible time, and piano, huh? Mm-hmm. And other than the brush hogging, the other project, pretty big project for today, is fixing up our blueberry swells a little bit. Things can get so out of control so fast in the summertime here with, with the weed control. We've really been trying to stay on top of it this year, but it's still trying to overtake us. So we did put weed fabric down on the blackberry swells, um, just where the blackberries are, but then the whole rest of the area has been getting overgrown. We've been having to cut out these really pokey weeds and weed eats and, um, <laughs> and we may end up using a natural weed killer spray with vinegar. Uh, we'll see. So we're just trying to do everything we can to stay on top of it and not allow um, the awful weeds to go to seed, especially around the food production areas. <laughs> Alright guys, so this has been a typical summer morning on the homestead here in the Ozarks. Um, we're a large family of nine, so it's really impossible to catch everything on video. I was able to run around and just get a few highlights. Guess who's still in bed though? <laughs> Biddle is still sleeping. It's after nine and she is still happily snoozing, which is good. She's only three, so kind of funny having one already back to sleep while the other still hasn't even woken up. Uh, everyone else is awake and moving. There's a lot happening today. Uh, quick announcement, we have turkeys. They just arrived this week. We had some friends hatch them out and they are the cutest little birds ever. So we're excited. They're Blue Slate, a heritage breed. And we've never done turkeys before. It's a whole new experience, but something we've been looking forward to. So I am gonna get back into those dishes and we'll catch back up with you later. All right guys, the morning is over. Dishes are done and now there's lunch dishes already piling up. We've just finished lunch and uh, Josh is already back out working on the blackberry swell as we speak. Uh, Kip is back at the brush hogging. He's almost done. The field looks so much better, but it is getting hot out. So probably in the next half hour, hour or so, everyone's gonna be slowly making their way back inside and we're gonna get fans going and just spend the afternoon trying to stay cool. We'll finish up some homeschooling and, and drink lots of water. <laughs> um, so thanks for joining us again on the homestead today. It's been a good morning. As always, we hope you all are staying well. We pray blessings over you and yours and whatever you do, do it with your whole heart. Feeling any better, Nate? Yep. Good. Not totally good yet, but pretty good. Cool. Is that Big Brother singing? <laughs>